Amy Winehouse's cause of death was confirmed by two separate coroner's reports and it was found that Amy's blood alcohol level was 416 mg per 100 ml, or five times the legal limit to drive. She had been trying to quit drinking at the time and a period of sobriety resulted in reduced tolerance which likely contributed to her fatal relapse on the 23rd of July. Yet the true cause of Amy Winehouse's death is likely more complicated than that. Those that were close to Amy, including her brother, Alex Winehouse, and close friend Naomi Perry revealed that the singer's bulimia played a significant role in her death, making her weaker and less able to endure the effects of her lifestyle. Nor can Amy Winehouse's death be explained without looking at her life. Her celebrated career was marked by controversy, a volatile personal life, and a persistent struggle with addiction that resulted in numerous stays in rehab. If we really want to understand how Amy Winehouse died, we need to take a closer look at her history.